were gonna draw salt and pepper. Yeah, shaker <laughs> with a funny face. <laughs> we hope you're gonna follow along with us. You need something to draw with and some paper and something to go with. Food is always better with a funny face. Mm -hmm. All right, you ready to start? Yeah. Let's first draw the salt shaker. We're gonna draw it over here on the left. I'm gonna draw a horizontal line. It's kind of tipped down a little bit. There you go. And then we're gonna draw another horizontal line right above it. And they're parallel. They're going along right next to each other. Yes. And then on the left, we're gonna connect and the right with a curve. Then let's draw the top of our salt and paper, pepper shaker. I'm gonna draw paper a- Paper shaker. Yeah. But <laughs> I'm gonna draw a curve, an upside down U. There we go. Now we could also draw, let's draw the little holes for where the salt and pepper comes out of. Well, the salt. So I'm gonna draw little curves at the top and I'm also gonna draw two more smaller ones below that. Yeah. And then we can color those shapes in. Now let's draw the rest of the shaker where the salt is. So we're gonna draw two diagonal lines coming out to the side, bottom. Then we're gonna draw longer diagonal lines coming down on each side. And towards the bottom, I'm making them come further apart so they get a little wider towards the bottom. Yeah, and then down here at the very bottom, let's draw a curve to connect these two lines together. And then let's also draw the salt inside. Now I'm gonna draw an oval shape that touches on both sides. All right, now we're gonna draw the other shaker, the pepper shaker. So we're gonna repeat all those same steps and we want them to look the same, uh, same size. So I'm gonna try to draw, repeat the exact same steps, but I'm gonna draw it tip, tip the other direction. So we draw those two lines next to each other. And then remember we connect the left and the right. And then we're, next we're gonna draw the upside down U shape. And it's okay if they look a little different, right? Yeah. Yeah, and we're gonna draw the, the little holes on the top of our shaker for where the pepper comes out. And I'm gonna draw two more circles below it and then color in those shapes. Now we're going a little fast and sometimes we speed up the video. Remember, if you need more time, you can always pause the video. All right, now let's draw the rest of the shaker. We're gonna draw the two diagonal lines, small diagonal lines coming out. And then let's draw the longer diagonal lines coming down and wider towards the bottom. Yeah, and then what was the next step? You curved the bottom. Yeah, connect the bottom with a curve. Draw that curve coming around and connect. All right, the next step is to add another oval shape inside. This is the top of the pepper. All right, Hadley, we did it, except we're, we still need to draw the best part. Mm -hmm. what, what is it? A funny face. <laughs> now I'm gonna draw their funny face up here towards the top. So I'm gonna draw two circles and maybe the salt is a girl and the pepper is a boy. Now let's add a smaller circle inside towards the top. And the reason why we're drawing the face towards the top of the salt and the pepper is so that we have room to add an S and also a P. Mm -hmm. So let's color in the big circle, but leave the little circle white. Now I'm gonna draw the mouth. I'm gonna draw a little curve in between the eyes. Oh, and you added eyelashes, I love it. Now I'm gonna draw a big U shape for the bottom. Now that's the cool thing about drawing funny faces is you don't have to draw them like how we're drawing. You, <laughs> you can draw them any way you want. I'm gonna add little circles over here for the eyes on this side, on the pepper, color them in, and color in this eye. And then this mouth, maybe I'm gonna do something different. I'm gonna add eyebrows too, just like you did. And maybe this mouth is just like yours, because I like yours so much. Is that a little tongue sticking out? Yeah. Okay. All right, let's add uh, the letter S over here for the salt and a P over here for the pepper. 
We did it, Hadley, we finished drawing our salt and pepper shaker, except we still need to do one more thing. What is it? Color them. Yeah, we need to color them. This part we are gonna fast forward one more time, but at the end, you guys can pause the video to take time to match the same coloring. All right, Hadley, you ready to fast forward? Yay! Hadley, give me five. You did such a great job on coloring your salt and pepper shaker. <laughs> I, I especially love their funny faces. Thank you. <laughs> Now you guys can pause the video right now to match the same coloring. We used markers and also colored pencils, but you can use whatever you have at home or in your classroom. We hope you had a lot of fun drawing your salt and pepper shaker. Yeah, we do. We hope you had a lot of fun, and we'll see you later, our friends. Goodbye! Bye -bye.